Hi guys, um, I'm going to show you um, how to configure BGP over IPsec tunnel. In my previous video, I've done the IPsec tunnel uh, with the static route. So we're going to continue from the same topology. Uh, I already have the IPsec tunnel uh, created. If you want to watch how to create IPsec tunnel, please watch my previous video. The link will be in the description below. So um, let's continue from where we left last time. At the moment, we can see we have our uh, tunnel is uh, configured and is working. Also, we can check uh, the traffic between uh, both sides. We have and it's working uh, on static route. So I'm going to remove the static route and configure BGP on top of it. So what we need to do. First, I'm going to uh, remove my static root. And uh, what we need to do for the BGP, we need to configure a redistribution profile. I'll call it connected. And click connected and add uh, my interface, which will be one, two, which is my uh, internal subnet. Then I'm going to BGP, I'm going to enable uh, IP address, well, oops, my public IP address. Sorry. My S number will be 64500. I'm going to install the roots and click peer group. I'm going to create my peer group, which will be um, called bgp dc2 and bgp dc2 tunnel 11 here i as will be 6500 interface will be tunnel 11 with IP 169.111 here two I'm going to configure the subnet that I'm going to uh, import I'm going to be BGP DC2 the one I just create uh, I'm going to import 172.20.20.0.24 and we'll be part of this group. Import DC2. And the next thing I'll do is going to redistribution. I'm going to be add and choose connected. And that's it from here. I'm going to create my policy as well. I have the IPsec which we created earlier. BGP the zone will be VPN destination will be VPN address will be one sixty nine one Okay, so we have source VPN and destination, same one. Application, we're going to choose BGP, allow an application will answer, this will be application default, action will be allow. 
that's it. So with this, what we have, we said we begin. Okay, we can commit. So let's go to the next one. Virtual router. Let's delete the static root that we have from the previous configuration. Redistribute profile. Connected. No. I forgot to click this on my previous one. I'm gonna have to go back. Leave it to commit again. Enable. Create the peer group again. So it's going to be. BGP. Let's see one. Eleven. Then we're going to import. Import DC one. We're going to match, so we want to import one seventy two sixteen twenty slash twenty four. And we want to take a distributed connected. And last bit, we need to do our policy. So VPN. Application will be BGP and we leave the rest as it is. Okay, and we're going to commit. So let's commit and then we can uh, we can do our test. Okay, commit has been done. Uh, we can test see if we have points yeah, it's working we can see this is dc1 internal and going to dc2 uh, internal network we can come and check our um, routing table if you go to bgp we can see beer pure connection has been established we can see our local rip here and also we can see uh, what we are advertising so this is dc2 is advertising 2020 subnet also same thing we can check on firewall uh, dc1 so you can see our peer established and the local rip and the one that we exporting so thank you very much guys if you like my video, please like and subscribe and see you next time.